Okay, guys. The Viper versus Bals. We are back to the 2K resolution. And you got to tell me if this looks much better or not. Or maybe you are exaggerated. Bals Aztecs, the Viper with the hands. Aztecs and hands. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Thank you for the pride, man. Really appreciate it. And this is going to be what? Uh, Aztecs and hands. Overlay. It's working, guys. It's really working. Okay. Let's see. Well, I think Baz was using poles and he loves to use poles for the for the crazy lame aggression, you know? Because poles can work with the village fight and so on. And uh, maybe it's not that bad, poles. It depends. Or maybe, as you say, he was trolling. But guys, Baz is with the Aztecs. The Viper with the hands. Uh, uh, Viper will have to play very, very strong and aggressive because Aztecs are a stronger civilization. I don't know what you think. But Balz is going with his Meso and probably he will wall completely, you know? We will wall completely, you know? Okay, let's see. There you go. Berries. We have the Lambert camp here. And we will see now. Okay, Lambert camp at the back. The goal. Oof, this map is wild. Look how open is the map for the snake. It's so open, man. Goal at the back. Goal in front on top of the hill. Okay. Vamos with the subscriptions. Let's go. Thank you, guys. Are we getting hype train? Come Seven on, man. months we... of total and brutal men. We don't get a hype train. Vamos. Oh, three in a row. Vamos. Let's go. Thank you, guys. Well, this is very nice to wall houses and palisades, or maybe another house. No, not another because it's 50 wood, remember? So he will palisade here. Yeah, and he's connected. You prefer the Aztecs or the hands, guys? Prefer the Aztecs or the hands? You gotta tell me. What do you prefer, guys? Aztecs or hands? Oh boy. Go, go, go with the hype train. Vamos, amigos. Okay. It's gonna take the elephant. Or not. Give me a moment, guys. Okay. But nay. Three on wood here. Beats. Thank you for the bits. But, but one question. Why 104? You know? 104. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. More hype train. Okay. Um, he's going to push now the Zebras. He's coming with the Eagle. Now let's see what the Viper is going to do here. But Pals is doing another failure. Okay. It was, it's only 18 population, you know. Thank you so much, Arto Mantis. Thank you for the new subscriber. Awesome, really, really great. Thank you for So, now that you are watching in the, in the, in the 2K resolution, is that much better that the, I did nothing. I just um, restart the stream and put the 2K resolution. That's what I did. <laughs> okay. This live amigos is, the tournament is recorded games except semifinals and finals. How many times do we have to say that? And why the why the hell is important for you if it's live or it's recorded games, man? My goodness, man. So boring with the questions all the time. Oh my god. Boring. Anyway. 
is private recorded games, the admin is giving the recorded games, and that's how it is. Okay, he's walling now. And Viper? He can see the malicious? He has two bullets on the berries, he need to wall more? No, he's fine. And those two bullets? No damage. He's gonna go stable? He's doing the stable. He doesn't care about the malicious, okay. He know that he's close, so it's okay. Oh my god, more beats. Well, he has one scout already, you have to be careful. And he's with the archie reigns, now the mill, the usual starting. What now Viper cannot do because he's doing quite a lot of farms, but without without the, the horse collar. Is he cannot make the archer range, so he's gonna try to take the spear. More scout, and now the scouts need to make counter attack. Yes. Let's he needs to attack. He needs to attack now forward the Viper. He's trying to come aggressive with the two militias and the eagle. This is Billis and the spear. You gotta be careful. And now he's gonna make an archer range here. There you go. But, put it now for the snake. Huh? He lost the spear. Now he's gonna try to kill one. He shouldn't lose ability here. Oh, okay. Might lose that one. No, he's saving, man. Que asco. He's always saving the villains, man. No matter if he's with quick walls or something. But, 2 HP villain. And didn't lose it. And now with the scout trying to attack his economy. One farmer, now doing more, and this is all wall, so he's fine. Let's see the snake. Okay. You gotta be careful. And... Okay, one, two, three, four, five farmers. Remember guys, if the Viper win this series, he will play tomorrow to Hera. And now... I'm gonna read the future. If he has promised in this series and he lose, people will say that he doesn't want to face Hera tomorrow. <laughs> okay, let's see now. Yeah, of course the 2K resolution makes a lot of difference with the, uh, with the details. It's much better for the details. Oh, careful there. Of course, people will. Oh, great Palisade Gate here. Because now he's gonna take everything. Yeah. Okay, he has more army balls. Six archers, two militias, two, two eagles, two spear. And uh, if you take the spear now, he's gonna destroy with the scouts. Yeah, Viper should be in a very good position now. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, he can go and clean. Maybe around. No? It's not going, but guys. Balls. Is walling like crazy. Walling like crazy. The Viper has 13 farmers. His opponent, 8 farmers. Okay, who is this? Thank you, man. Let's go. Sadly, the high friend stop it in what level? In level 3. Not bad. But now he's coming with the scouts and pulse. Arena walls. Arena walls 100%, you know? Okay. I'm gonna come with the assets, but guys, the Viper has 21 on food. 21 on food is a lot. He's gonna mine the gold at the back. And obviously, if you are able to keep going with this army Thank and Viper, for real? Oh my god, who is this? Richard underscore the underscore is donated 10 euros and 25 cents. Amazing. Great stream and casting, great weekend. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Try my best with the stream. But I want to improve more. And tomorrow, guys, uh, more details from Warlords 2, okay? So uh, stay tuned, because tomorrow we don't only have the quarterfinals. We also will have more news. I will have to... I will show you a beautiful video tomorrow that you're going to love it. I hope so. I hope so. It's going to be inside... Man, look at the economy for the snake. That's pretty sick. 
pretty sick. He has not, he's not doing fletching, but his macro is just being OP. Really, really OP. Now, uh, without the fletching, it's, it's more complicated to stop him from building those houses, but just look, guys. The Viper has already two villages more because of the wheelbarrow, all right. And he's up to castle man. Uh oh. Ooh! You need to wall! Viper noticed? I think he did. Okay. Okay, okay. He walled it, but no. Oof. If he didn't wall, that was brutal, you know? Maybe even a stone wall. No, no, no. It's not. He lost a villager. Obviously, he's up very quick. And you could not say, oh, he's greedy really up. No. You know, he's not greedy really up because he has army. 12, 13 army. Two villages more still because he did wheelbarrow. And now those scouts. Not gonna be a note against the arches. He has to wait the skirmishers or he will waste the scouts and you don't want to do that Bloodlines now with bloodlines. Maybe he can hold Skirmishes are coming and now fletching and now the question is is this the a signal that he's gonna go cap archers? Mm, okay, we'll see Gotta be careful. He's going back a little bit Fletching bloodlines and uh oh Nah, this army is gonna destroy, and he's still not up. Whoa. Okay, the scouts are gonna hold. Gonna take the eagles. Vals is now up. 39 villages, 11 army. But the momentum now, the timing, guys, is for, is for the snake. He cannot trap himself. Let's go, Vals upset. All those arches going to be bye bye. Let's go, Vals upset. Wonder boy. You, 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 it's a viper hater, man. Or just a Bals fanboy? What do you think, guys? Fanboy? Bals fanboy or hater from the Viper? Aye, aye, aye. There's no haters in my channel. Or I hope so. Anyway, light cap, husbandry. Upset fanboy. <laughs> He's doing the light caps. Yes, I think it's a good choice to go the light caps. Uh, in case that he's going eagles, or in case that he's also doing monks. The Viper, two TCs. The good thing with this is that in this situation, the eggs are very dangerous, but you need to be ahead. You need to mass. Uh, with this approach right now, the Viper is in a good position, you know, because he's having the, the numbers here. And now he's going to try to break in two spots. That's good. That's really good. Okay, but he won't be able because he's aware and he's checking this. Trying to go look at the walls. Man, these balls play so defensive with the walls here and uh, I don't know so have been going more army maybe in the start and then do the market approach like more doubt style that is uh, going all all crazy with the meso sieves but now five eagles is three barracks now his opponent got five knights five light caps so right now the viper no problem no problem, but Aztecs is so complicated. So, he cannot lose the army or can can snowball. Yeah, he's trying to break. He will. Skirmishes with the plus one. He's gonna make a house, but yeah, he's doing the house here. Oh, he break it in the north. Oh, yes. He break it. This is what Viper is trying to go for. The, oh, and now he break it. Well, this is game probably. It's crazy, but yeah, look at the Viper now attacking with the Knights. Look at the skirmishes. Light gets going to the north. This is absolutely brutal move by the snake. Trying to be very aggressive and well, trying to do the job, but you have to be careful. It's a lot of army, man. The Knights are okay. He got pikes, but that's the thing. He had to do pikes plus two. He's spending a lot in the army. That's complicated. Okay, but Viper is losing some military here. Yeah, that's the problem. He's gonna kill another? Yeah, he killed. I think Viper could, could have probably get a little bit better trade with this. It's hard to say. The pikes are there, and as I said, plus two armor. Yeah, but no eagles. Oh, he also break in the north. Wow, the Viper destroyed Bals in the first game, 95 APM, 72. He break also here, and look. Very strong play by the Viper. Yeah. 
you can see that the efficiency at the bottom right corner was pretty clear and Viper was, yeah, he dominated in this one. Really, really dominated in this one. Military, 35-19, economy, it was similar echo in total. But Val was going with more goal approach and the difference here was that two minutes faster with guns, two minutes faster is a lot. Game two, let's go. Okay, guys, game number two, the Viper versus Pals, Mahyars, Japanese, Japanese, as I said, you, you can, you can vote in the pool, not in the chat, you know, vote and I will, I will take decisions, depend on the result, so vote and see, Pals, Japanese, the Viper, Mahyars, okay, yellow, Mr. The Viper, Pals is a blue, I will show you the sieves, but I prefer Mahyars. I mean, Japanese can be very strong. Yes, it can. Okay. Do you prefer Mahyars as well as I do, guys? I think the forging approach here for free, the scout cheaper, the mobility is solid, but the 50% cheaper mills, the infantry 33% attack faster. It can be crazy, right? Can be really crazy honestly so yeah okay well he has a lumber cam in the in the north too far well this wood is much better here for the viper very close to the tone center and remember that the shore fish it has to be the goal you know? it has to be the goal you know yeah okay Triple on wood and board at the back. Gonna take it now. Yeah, I mean, I think the mill should have been here earlier because the short fish is the faster food income, you know. So, yeah. It finished the pool already or not? This is still there, it's 50%. But it's pretty obvious that who is not voting is because they have no problems with the resolution. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, he can see now the mill. We never see many times with Mahyars, and they get also forging for free. But definitely mobility might be better. And you don't want to fight many times against Japanese, probably. We'll see. Oh, the Viper is walling. Is the snake on a wall? Oh boy, interesting. Oh, po -po -po. Okay. Well, honestly, watching Age of Empires in mobile is bad in general. Like, how to watch this game in mobile? I mean, I have to do this for you to, to watch properly in mobile. You know? And then you can watch properly. Yeah. Anyway, he's walling. He's gonna wall all this area? No, maybe he's gonna... Where is he gonna make the barrack? Yeah, the Viper might be a little bit too worried about the Japanese approach. He's doing the malicious. But I don't know what the Viper is doing. I think he might do a scout doing the barrack now in this area. Okay. The wood is kind of exposed. And he can see it. Balls. 
Now the Vipers see the militias. These games, guys, can be very snowball. You know? This map is super snowball, and a bad battle can be a destruction for the players, you know? So let's see what is gonna happen here, you know? Okay. Gotta be careful there. RT range, you're gonna is walling now and is not going to scout. Okay. He's playing the most safe approach here, the Viper. And if he wall this, he knows that he's gonna go through and oh four militias. That's four men at arms. The north is open. But the Viper will have archers soon. I mean, he's not mining gold. Okay. Double attacks, men at arms. He's walling a little bit. He's definitely the most defensive approach by the snake. But, uh, well, safe. Save one. And if he's able to put three, four arches, then all the men at arms aggression is kind of kind of gone. Okay. Yeah, he's walling. And he will wall another? Ooh, almost. Almost. But now nah, he has the spear now. He got this one. The archers are there. It's stable now. Oh, that mill. That mill for the Viper. Wow. Okay. That's a mill that uh, some of my mods will be proud. You know? A little bit closer, no? Or, or it's not that far? Is just the effect of the hill? It's okay. It's only one tile, that. Maybe it's only one tile, actually. Maybe. Okay. And I'm surprised he did the mill on the berries. It's two tiles, right? Yeah, it's a little bit of Titanic. But it's okay. He didn't lose anything. And now the archers are going back. But why he's doing this table? Because he knows that he's going to come in skirms. And you cannot go all the archers. Okay. The snake is... Wallet. What? Okay, not pop, 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 pop. Double is stable now. Wow. Really, really wow. Okay. You gotta be careful. No, no, no. Yeah, well, Viper has no fletching. He's gonna try to kill the skims. The skims die so fast against the against the scouts, as you can see. Oh my god. Well, he's gonna lose the scout, but he's coming with more. And I have the feeling that now the Viper is gonna destroy his opponent. Yeah. He did the RT range first, which I like it. Then, he's killing all the scams. Great micro here. And then, eh, he's not attacking properly now with that man at arm. Yeah, now he's gonna take the scam. And if you kill that spear. Okay, well, population is still almost the same. Look at the blastmith. He don't want to make farms. You don't need farms in this map. Second RT range, okay. Do you think Viper needs Fletching? I think he does, but he has no goal, so he can't do Fletching at all. He's still spamming scouts anyway. A lot of scouts now. Really a lot of scouts. So we will see if he's gonna make economy. This is a mill? Not the best mill, if you ask me, but well, it's protected. Well, he has so it's fine. It is really fine. It's killed by the armor, guys. He's mining gold with two Valyrs. You can see how those berries are far from the mill. Yeah, we were right. And all this is wall. So you need to go through this area in front of the wood lane. Not like this. Okay, fully wall. The Viper can't see. Viper has killed 10 units. Only lost four. And now he's doing a tower. Okay. But he's gonna come through this area too. Palisade gate? Not really. And where's the fletching? Now he's not doing a mining camp. Not doing a mining camp. Hmm. Alright. Need to go away.
I like that they obstacle to mine stone, but he has only two spears, guys. Only two spears when his opponent has ten scouts with plus one, plus one, no bloodlines, you know. Yeah, that spear is annoying, but he's coming with skirmishes. Skirmishes with already fletching. 17 army, 11. Viper playing aggressive. This battle gonna be huge. The scouts are coming. Wow. There's so many units here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So many scouts with the skirmishes. And honestly, how Vals is gonna stop this? He has good economy. Okay. But now it won't be able to take the shortfish. His skirmishes are coming. The Need scouts are going to be there. Already no beer with man. Thank you, man. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. What re resolution do you prefer? Pretty clear. You know, pretty clear. So, I will take the decision. Thank you guys for voting. All right. Let's see the skirmishes. And? Oh, it's gonna take it. I wonder why the other 1,500 viewers or 400 viewers didn't vote, guys. You are lazy or you don't really love the resolution or you don't care what resolution because you want to watch it no matter what. If I stream 100p or 200 2k, 4k because you love the, tor the, 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 the channel. Thank you, guys. Oh, he's going to take it. And now look at the amount of scouts he's killing, man. The Viper is playing so aggressive. He's taking absolutely everything. And it's total and brutal domination by the Viper, man. What the hell? What the hell? 2-0, guys. 2-0. And the Viper is playing like my resolution. 2K, man. Holy moly, man. Yeah, pretty, pretty strong the snake. 25-12. Economy. 300 resources only. But look at the food. And he spam so many units. Yeah. 14 scouts while his opponent 11 archers. I'm surprised that Bals pick this map against the Viper. Honestly. Yes. Game 3, let's go. Game number 3, guys. Game number 3. Romance, the Viper, the Mongols. The Mongols. All right. As a yellow, the Viper as always. Bals as a blue. And this map, wild. Haboob. One question, guys. Is finally Romans going to win a single game in a tournament? Because they don't win, man. I mean, they might have won some, but they they lose most of the times. You know? Or not? Is the ratio win-losses good? I think Romans are... Are, uh, are dying, man. They, they are dying, man. Like, seriously, what is this? Anyway, I believe in Viper. The Viper. Okay, no bettings, uh, Comboes. Enjoy with the games, no bettings today. Okay. Well, we know about the Mongols. Romans, we have seen that people is going men at arms and then into cuckoo strategies. But the, the Viper has played the first two games really good. Like, really, really good, you know? Let's see. Roma from Romans. Well, why? They're very close. If you want to go aggressive with Romans, this is a good opportunity. I believe that Romans should work very good in a very close and aggressive mass. Not close as arena, when the players are close to each other. You know? Anyway. Uh-oh. Nope. Well, the Viper, the Viper has been 2-0 lead in this tournament. And he's playing this decider because he lost when he was 2-0 lead. Yes, that's why he's here right now. So, let's see. There you go. Eight villages. Taking the elephant. 13 population for both players. And now doing the house. Remember, houses cost 50 wood. Okay? Obviously, Viper is in another level than Bals. But you have to play as he did in the first two games. Really great because Bals is a dangerous player. And very, very competitive, you know? Really competitive. Yay. Ready. 
Okay. It's 15 population for both. Come on, for now, everything is a standard. Yay. Let me just check. He has explored more. Both hands explore each other. It's not like other maps. Here yeah. you explore. I want to see where your where your opponent has the woodland to prepare some potential aggression. Right now, Baz doesn't know. He explored this area but didn't see it. Didn't go to the right yet. Barak and now Loom. Okay. Well, I believe this is the test they are doing, Mango File. So maybe, maybe it is. Thanks for casting another tournament, man. My pleasure. I cast all the tournaments. This is my passion and this is my job. So it's what it is, man. Okay. Barak in front. There is pickle wall like this. Ooh, I think it's gonna be idle, TC. Yep. Because he didn't have the buildings, so now he's going with seven seconds idle town center, and militias are coming from Bals. He's gonna do another. Well, he need the gold first. And the Viper. What is Viper doing? He's not going militias. If he's not mining gold. Okay, houses. He's on the other side. And the militias are coming. He see the wood now. And the snake. Can see the militias, so he will wall with palisades, I believe. No, house, but it's 50 wood. This is not good. Oh, this is bad. Ooh. As I told you, I mean, well, Viper is using so much wood to make these house walls. So, right now, the question you were asking, Mango File, doesn't lose likes. This is a tower. 24 seconds. It's an annoying tower. And uh, it's not in time. So, what is Viper doing here? I have no clue, to be honest. He's gonna go scouts. He doesn't have a mill either. So, I have no idea what the Viper is planning to do now. Let's see. He's doing an archery range. So, he's not really using the, the Roman's uh, strength. He has no goal. He's gonna go skirmishers. The tower is far from the wood. Maybe with pledging will be better. And now he's mining a stone here. But Bals is doing something nice. He's going aggressive, you know? Another house. Remember that these houses are a lot of wood. So, killing these houses, well, it's hard. He's gonna have one archer and he's not many gold, so I don't know what the Viper is doing. Well, for now, walls. No problem. Yeah. Maybe he should put the archer inside. Inside the wood. Why not? Okay. Well, he's gonna micro, it's better. So it's fine. Yeah, he will micro all the time. No problem. And here with the archer range, too. Now, skirmishers? He will. Do his skirmishes, but he has no goal with the spear and don't even have the mill, so you can't make farms. He's gonna mine gold finally. Yes, he is. Well, doing the mill now, similar approach, doing the mining camp. No mining camp yet. What he's not doing? Oh, this tower is needed now. Oh my. He need more villains. He's gonna try to trap him. He's gonna try to trap him. Let's see, because he has the skin. Let's see the scout. He's doing the house here. The tower is gonna be up. The skimmers is on the archer. The scout is bye bye. At least he denied a little bit those men attempts to kill, but he need to micro. Ooh. Okay, that tower is not tapped yet. And the skimmers are coming. Military numbers. Pulse has one minute and six seconds. Idle tone center, guys. You know? One minute, he's now Viper losing a billion, but he has the tower here as well. And he has two towers, so it is a problem that he has the mill. No, Viper needs the mill. The wood is, ooh, and now he has to be careful. Micro, very important. No, he's not letting him. He's super fast with this, faster than Bals. Yeah, and almost killing that one. So he's doing a lumber camp at the back. I like that. 
Piper has lost one volume, but with the idle time, Baz is losing more. He has no stone, and he won't be able to repair the tower forever if he's still going like this. So we will see. Okay. Yeah, he, he did what he wanted the whole game. It's true that now he's coming with pure skirmishers. And maybe he's gonna kill those villagers. So he's gonna lose a villager, man. Yeah, it's... Ooh, he didn't lose it at the end. Okay, gonna repair that tower or not? He has to repair, why not? This is very low HP, but the others are gonna hold a little bit the position. And, and, there you go. That villager is gonna go down. Maybe he's gonna save it. We'll see if Buzz is gonna save it. Okay, he did it. But that beautiful villager is going to be in troubles. Now, a house, and that villager is dead. Or not. Oh my god, that villager. He blocked himself now. He blocked his viper. He killed himself, and the villager is alive. Well, that wasn't great. And now Balz is two villages ahead. He lost three villages. Now he's gonna take this one. Or not. He got it. Okay. He's raining less now. Population almost the same. And he's gonna take houses that cost 50 wood, remember? Which is expensive, man. Really expensive. Mining a lot of stone now. Double attacks. He got double attacks too. Okay. And now Viper has six skirmishes, two spears. Balz is doing archers. Archers without fletching. Okay. I mean, in general, I prefer archers, but... Okay, another house going to be down. Oh, Viper, you need a you need a tower on the wood. Is he gonna notice? He need a tower, and he's doing the tower now, because the archers are coming. No, no, no. You need to go back. The good thing for Viper is that he has no fletching, so he's gonna be fine. Yeah. Also, Snake will need to save the wood. He's coming with archers around, and the game is uh, it's. Pals in a better position, man. Yeah, the Viper is now getting on quite a lot of idle TC too, because his economy is kinda cuckoo. Will Barrow now. Okay. Solid, how many farms? Six farmers. The snake, six farmers as well. All right, there is only one difference. Ready. Only one difference, he lost three villages on the bottle. And now the snake, what is he doing? Skirmishes 340 gold. He's doing the blast bit now, but there's still no fletching for his opponent. Did he okay? He's doing the blast bit as well. Okay, fletching this upgrade is what matters a lot. Population almost the same is by far the closer game up from the series. The other has been quite fast. Remember, guys, that there is one series more to watch Tatot versus freaking Andy. Tatot versus freaking Andy. Well, I'm curious to see that one. You know, Tatot is the favorite for sure. It's crazy experience. And freaking Andy is just getting there. Like trying to get into the latest stages in the tournament, right? Yay. We'll know that. for the great cast. My pleasure, man. Who is that? Punk813. Thank you, man. We all know that we liked also a lot uh, Andy in this channel we, because of the Raid Forest and you know, he has been in the channel quite often, he's a lover boy. But Tato should be the favorite, guys. Or not. He should be, guys. He should be. And the winner of that series will face tomorrow Leary. Ay, ay, ay. Leary Tato, potentially? What the hell, quarterfinals, right? Okay, be careful here. Let's see this. 13 army, 11. Two villages more now. Balz a little bit more idle again. And Fletching, but armor as well for blue. Need to be careful. Are we going to see now a stable? I'm trying to check the map. But Balz is starting to use the market like crazy. Is the Viper using the market? Uh, I'm not sure if he did the market. So let's see. Yeah, look at the crazy man. Yeah, man. Okay, okay. Oh, 1440p is back. Thanks, man. Well, I wanted that you guys compare and check what is better resolution. I believe that this quality is insane because, yeah, many people have said during many, many months. Oh, 
But look at balls, man. The market, 21 on wood, 9 on foot, 7 on gold. But the market, holy moly, man. Holy moly. And now the Viper also bought it. Well, four months both. in a row. Vamos, mem, let's go. Well, Viper has a mango file, four villages more. It's not only about the percentage. Thank you so much, Savanguard. Um, and resources. Pals got more resources. More wood, more food, more gold. Viper only has more stone. Oh boy. Doing a tower here. Poor scholar. He did it with Barrow, you know? For Scholar now. And what is the Viper going to do now? Stable. Is he doing a stable as well or not? Look at the army for both guys. Similar. Very similar. He has the stable and the RT range. Doing the bloodlines. He's gonna go Lancers. He's gonna go Cap Archers. He's gonna go Knights, Camels. What? Well, that tower. I like it. It's annoying. And these villages are. I mean, if there are three towers there, I think they are in danger. This area is a dangerous one. Seriously. I don't know what you think, but it's definitely a dangerous one. This is open, by the way. And now second is stable. Can Blue see it? And here he can. Bloodlines as well. And let's see now who's going to get the advantage. Ooh, double the stable too. Okay. 15 second difference. This is Lancers. Lancers and Monastery. This is gonna be nice. I believe he will do Knights. Knights. And look at the stone, guys. Are we gonna see the unique units? I will love it. They are nice. Oh, they are cold, guys. Ooh, for Fenturions, right? Awesome. Okay, TC on the wood. Not doing the castle right away. Viper always like to go tone centers. Uh-oh. Uh oh, oh come on, balls, balls! What are you doing, man? Ay ay ay! Well, bad reaction, not really good. He lost two villages here. Now the knights are in danger because there's mm, three towers. Oh man, the lancers! He can see the viper or not? Oh, he saw this. Well, he was expecting. He's gonna make the town center. He will. Oh, he can touch. I can't believe it, man. Oh, man. Oh, seriously, the one range. He's gonna lose one village. Probably gonna lose another. No. He lost one. Okay. He's still five villages ahead. But he got Will Barrow, so he's very close. The knight is gonna die. The knight is going to die. Oh, boy. The monks will help. And here the knights. Oh, but, uh, I, what I said, guys. What I said that this village were in a danger position. Why he keep those there when you see that your opponent is gonna go nice and you can raid? That's weird, man. Really weird. He lost already five balls and mainly was in front, you know. Doing now the TC number three, nine villages ahead. It's true that Val has more army, but he's not mining a stone. No, Viper is also not mining a stone. But this is a problem. Three TCs, two tone centers. And I don't see that he has really too much now that he can dominate to the snake. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He converted a Lancer. And the monk is gonna go down. No, no, no. Need to go back. Need to go back. And he's going back. It's the tournament settings, not the tournament rules. They changed and made custom, you know. You can make different settings if you want, right? Okay, farmers. Light cap now. Still didn't take any relic. And he got very close. Siege war shot. Um, I'm thinking. Do the Romans have redemption? I always... I don't know yet. I'm sorry, guys. My bad. But I don't remember. I don't remember, guys. It's too many saves. Yes, right? Okay. So maybe the siege war shop is not ideal here. It's true that he has balls, a lot of lancers, 11 lancers, but two monks, six knights, one lancer converted. 
What is Kirby said? Taking a nap? Okay. And now doing the plus one. With plus. Ooh. No, no, no. Oh, that's that's really bad. Just do the lead. It's converting one. Okay. Didn't convert. But this is the, the, the disgusting now. Okay, he converted back again. Now the monks, you gotta be careful. It's going to go back. The monks is very important. He's now coming from behind to try to take to take the monks and the mangonel probably. Yeah, but it's really difficult when there's so many lancers, but he can. He's now going to commit. Yes, and now oh that micro wasn't the best. And now he's gonna lose the mangonel. That's huge, honestly, because he's stopped the push. He lost all the monks and the siege. Now the monks from the Viper are also in danger, but he converted. He converted two lancers. And that's huge. Army number 11, 9. He's losing the army production. So right now the Viper is getting a very, no, a super strong advantage. 14 villages more. Military numbers almost the same. Okay. But where's the knights? He's ready, guys. He's raiding the wood line. And look at the Echo KD, which is huge. Very important. It's taking a lot. It's really taking a lot. Those two stables will be better in those frames. Close to the TC, so then it will be in the range of the tone center and you can finish them. Right now he can't. The Viper has only one monk now. He's gonna come and convert or try. Yeah. And oh who didn't convert anything now. And the Viper is doing oh my god. He bought it the castle as well. Because he see that Pulse is coming with the castle forward, but with only six valleys. It's normal to make Guy is a castle with six bullets on his face. You need more. At least 12, I don't know. But six is too little. Anyway, but it's not different. As you can see, it's, it's really big in favor of the Viper. Like, really, really big. So, let's see. <clears throat> One, two, three tones entered. And now the castle here. Well, that castle is not really achieved too much. Just the stables. But Viper is not even there with the economy. Like, it's not a bad castle, but it's not a great one. This one is protecting his base, his TC, at least. You know, so, yeah. Okay. <laughs> 16, 17 villains more now doing Will Barrow. Viper can spam knight if you want. He has a good boom going now. I mean, don't have Will Barrow. He's doing no bosso, no heavy blow. Well, but he's also missing those. Following. Another follower, what the hell? Vamos! Vamos, guys, we need to, to reach the next year 200k followers. It's almost impossible, but... <laughs> but it would be great. Oh! Will Barrow, Heavy Plow. Doing another tone center. One, two, three, and this is the fourth TC. So, now with Heavy Plow, Started to spam farms. The five percent more economy that you get with romance and some small ratings. It makes that the difference is getting bigger and bigger. And the viper is gonna face Hera tomorrow, guys. You know, he's gonna face Hera tomorrow, man. Yeah, man. The viper is gonna face Hera tomorrow. Remember that the tournament is not only the title. There's a logo over the score from the players. You know. It's everything there, guys. Class of Empires. It's uh, a tournament with a uh, $12,000 prize pool. And uh, we are watching already the deciders. And tomorrow, the quarterfinals. Next weekend, semifinals and grand final. Domination. Okay. Chain Bard in armor now. Snake has 20 bullets more. He's coming with some Mago Dice. The plasmid is gonna be done. Uh, I think he will have the plus two. And Viper is spamming Knight and Light Caps. Also, he has few monks. So be. Okay. Well, this castle is a lot more annoying. You know? It's more annoying for sure. He's taking farm to TC. Okay. Does he has the range? Yeah, he can take the tone center, as you can see. 
It's only 12 villains difference now, because now Viper is losing villains here. They lead the farmers, yes. And still make Lambert caps on this side. Exactly what he's doing. It's also true that you can expand your economy all over. There's a lot of, a lot of space is still empty. And now guys, let's see. Lancers, Mago Dice and the Mago Bell. Is gonna do the job or not? We'll see. Look at the score. The Viper is ahead in population, but not as much as it could be, right? And imagine if Valve now is able to go up to Imperial faster. That could be deadly with two castles close to his pace. Okay. And it looks like he's gonna go up. Valve is preparing his transition to Imperial. And Trebuchet and Mago dies. Oh boy. It's complicated. It's definitely complicated. All right. There's no ballistic. That's why they are not taking so much damage with those. Mago dies the knights, but the Viper has a lot of farming. It's not being greedy. It's doing army, man. It's doing a lot. Of Nine knights in the queue. If he unqueue all of them, he could go Imperial, guys. But he's not doing. So he's spamming army to try to do what? He's gonna go. He's gonna try to kill the castle with rams. What? The hell? Where's the rams? He's coming, guys. Whoa! Yeah, he's walling, and now... Well, Magoda is behind these walls, might take the rams. He's going to go around, look at Bals, trying to be a very, very aggressive. Here, the Viper, he's been defensive. Where's the Magoda? A lot of Magoda is coming here, but he's gonna go or not? No! Okay! He's gonna lose a ramp, but he's going inside with the nice. Now he's gonna take the tall center, the, the gate or what? So many knights. But look at the Viper, he's going wild with the castle close to the Viper castle. What the hell is this castle? Okay, oh, he need more villages. Whoa! Imperial Age. Imperial Age for Vals. It looks that Vals could take this game. Maybe. Maybe the rams are in the hell. The castle is not gonna be up. Is the viper throwing this game or he is still in a good position? I don't know. Oh, okay. He's getting in now with the knives, but he also kind of trapped himself. He's gonna lose a lot. Oh my god. There is also many knives. The castle is gonna be up. Want to kill this one. Kill this number 115 87. The viper is killing a lot. A lot. And now the castle, a beautiful one, is there trying to kill it. My goodness! Okay! Wild game! It's rare to see the Viper playing this aggression. Not very often. Not very often. And now he's in the Imperial Pulse with 90 bullets, 118. He needs to take this castle. Or Viper is bye-bye. We'll see. The Ram is gonna go down. The castle is gonna help. Taking this one is very important. Plus three and chemistry. He has the other one here. And obviously... Only with one castle, Bals, it's gonna be more complicated, but he still have 22 Mago Dice. 22 Mago Dice. And you all know, guys, that the Mago Dice are not terrible units. They are okay. They are really okay. Now, Husbandry and this castle is down. The score still say that Bals is much ahead, but population is the same. Obviously, Bals has the timing, the momentum. Yes. He's gonna make chemistry now. And well, Viper is still have 48 farmers. The Viper has 30 bullets more. But you can't wall. This is the beauty also of this map. You can't wall 100%. This gap will always be there. You know? Okay, he's doing Botkin. But University. You say that he's gonna go skims? I don't see skims at all. Definitely not. My good guys are coming. Trebuchet. Amazing game. Let's go! Bravo! Amazing! Very well played! He did two castles forward. I was skeptical with the first, but the second I said, that's a better castle. And then when we saw that he was going to go up to Imperial, it was like, hey! He's going Imperial, and in a map like this, the Imperial matters a lot. Really, really a lot. Whoa. Military. Nice. Bald skill, 40 units more. Economy. The Viper got a lot more Echo in general, but he never reached Imp. 
and boss Imperial Age and domination from there. Game 4, let's go! Game number 4! And, uh, ooh, I like it. Portuguese versus Gurjaras, the Viper versus Bals. And this is a very interesting matchup. I prefer Portuguese, but in a map like this that they are far and is aggressive, careful with Gurjaras, you know? Careful with Gurjaras. I didn't change the three mod. Yeah, I forgot. And I'm not gonna go back now. So it's okay. Um, Portuguese, Gurjaras. Are you ready to rumble, guys, and see some crazy game? Or it's gonna be... Mm. Oh my god, thank you guys! Remember that it's September, and uh, it's cheaper for the new subscribers, you know? And well, you can check the command and see what is the offer, because I'm a noob and I don't know. But there's a command and it's there, man. Also with the gifts and... Well, I don't know. There's a... There's a offer during the whole September. Alright? Uh, what happened, man? I'm trying to put the overlays, but the overlays are not working. Goodness. Okay, I will try again. Portuguese. Yeah, now it's there. And Gujaras. Okay. Okay, so which one do you prefer here? Because I think it's a smoother Portuguese. They are very strong. But if you reach Castle with Gujaras, those riders, camels... It's dangerous civilization, guys. It's dangerous if, honestly. And for the later game, you know, uh, Khazars, no Khazars. It's complicated, man. It's really complicated. I hope Gujarat's green. I want a decider. That's a good that's a good point. Decider wouldn't be terrible, right? It wouldn't be terrible. Yeah. Okay. The map. The map is a land map. Um, you know, it's just a full of, uh, Arabia map, let's say, but not Arabia. Because it has different things, as we said. Resources are not the same. The wood is not as consistent. This can be potential holes all over, you know, and it's complicated. Really complicated. But, let's see. He has three bullets on wood. Look at the lumber cam. Okay. And these berries are not great. In front and top of that kill. Not ideal. Then the goal, one on the right side. The stone kinda at the back, but you know, far. All the stone closer. This goal, I don't dislike. It's close to all the resources. One tower here could protect everything. But it's still a little bit exposed, that's also the truth. While, I mean, if he's on top of that hill, you can wall this area and that goal might be safer. Here. Actually, I like more Bal's position in the map. It's a little bit closer to the edge of the map. So in case that he wants to go defensive, it's easier to wall, even with the inconsistency of the wood lines, you know? Yeah. Um, he's on close to the corner, but less. So a little bit more to the middle of the map, if you notice. Also those, well, you can wall. We'll see. Are they gonna go scouts? Gonna go militias? The map is so big. I think the scouts mobility will be the best here. I don't know. I might be wrong. We'll see. Mem flex. If I per 10 second I don't TC, why that? Yeah, fish boom. Well they don't have shortfish. You know? It's only one per pond, so it's not great. You know? Oh. Balt is up! 18 population, what the hell? Okay. And Viper is going up too. With two villains more. Two villains more. Doing the barrack in top of that hill. And pushing the last Zebra. If we check, he only can see his base. Same as Balls, who is already doing the barrack to protect that male. Alright. Oh, really right. Who has no loom? Piper has no loom. Well, you don't expect with Gurjaras to come malicious, you know? For how is the build order for Gurjaras? It would be weird, right? You need the early mill, then the Lambrican, you really don't have the resources to go malicious that early at this stage of the game, you know? So it makes sense. 
It's okay. It is really okay. All right. He's gonna wall now. He's gonna try to wall some. The Viper. Interesting. And Archie range. He never goes scout. Right? Well, might, might go sometimes, but not in these cities. I think the opening never scout for balls. Feel more confident with archers, it seems. Okay. And now, this is a camel. And the no loom now. Oh, Viper lost it. You know, he was greedy. No loom. And now, and now, and now. Oof. Amos losing another. You know? Okay. Yeah, he's now doing this table. The loom is already done. Remember that this uh, faster loom, so you gain also a little bit of that time that he lost with the idle TC. And he's gonna wall now on the right. Stable is gonna be there. And well, kill it a Valir because of the loom. The no loom, actually. So it was good at the end, four balls. Very nice. He's gonna lose the camel. No, he pay attention. Good job. And you were talking, it's not too far from going Arches. I think so. You know, I think so, but well, if you feel confident like this, I mean, he didn't explore Viper, he doesn't even know where his opponent is. So, let's see, he's gonna find it. He will. Oh man, oh man, Viper, he lost half HP of that scout. Disaster, more than half HP, 30 HP. What the hell? Well. He might know that he's in the corner. Completely opposite corner. He's doing the scouts. And now he's, he knows that exactly. He's doing the RT range. RT range right away. Why? <laughs> he's two archers and two spears. He can create some chaos there. The RT range is not yet up. Now he is. Now it is. Sorry. And how many of on berries? Only... Four. Well, it's fine. And remember that you get wood also. No, no, no. What? The archers are helping a lot, man. He's losing the spears for nothing. Well, maybe just get in time, but... Why he lost two spears for almost nothing? Anyway, skirmishes are there. You need to kill the archer. Ah, he's not shooting. Now fletching. Yeah, now he will kill. Oh, no, really? I need to go back. The Viper still have same army, but just the village that he lost. It's table finally. Nice. We're gonna have action in village. I love it. I really do love it. Okay. How many scouts are those? Five. Still didn't find his. Uh... Yeah. His opponent. It's already six villages on berries that also give you wood constantly. It's slow, but it's like the farms. I'm sorry, like the like the ships in the, the jars. Too much. By the way, he has only six. Maybe he took also. He, he, yeah, he's eating actually now. Okay. Interesting. Need to go back. That camel, he could kill it. Just kill it now. What the hell? It was a slow. Yeah, six scares and six scouts. Now he's starting to wall. Oh, Viper is playing safe. He's walling all. Well, he see that his opponent has walled pretty much everything, right? So he's now going to find the resources. See the mail, see the wood, the gold at the back. And he can see that his map is good, man. What? Yeah, he chopped that, that the struggler. But well, he got fletching, remember? He got fletching, so you need to attack that archer. I think he will kill it. Oh. Not anymore, but now he will. That's fine. Scout's going away. And is he starting to be quite some army here? Oh boy. And no fletching yet. The Viper can be in problems if he's not paying attention. Now he's walling, but... Okay, he has a good amount of scouts, so he should be fine. Still fletching, but check Gujarat's resources. Gujarat's resources are looking healthy right now. Are looking really good. And uh, he doesn't have four scholar, but Viper either. And, or neither. And this is Fletching. Well, Fletching now for the Viper. Two villains ahead, Bals. Viper 23 seconds LTC. Bals 
three seconds idle tone center, which is amazing. No idle tone center, and he's about to go up. I smell a decider. It, it, it's, I mean, it's early, you know, but well, it's playing good, Vals. Piper has more army, yes, but look at those resources. Whoa. Okay. I did a decider game in the decider series. Could be. Could really be. All right. After this series, Tatito. All right. And tomorrow, quarterfinals. Sick. 15 GMT, remember? Let's see if I have time to sleep tonight. Because, my goodness, what is this? Oh, got it. He's up, man. He's up. Gujaras. He has a stable, second archery range. And uh, Bals is on the way to Castleage. He's on the way to Castleage. I think the Viper has a lot of army. But he's not using forward. So, his opponent is fine. Completely fine. Horse collar, goal mine, and upgrade. And now, what is going to be the approach? Crossbows and riders. Could be. Ooh. This is bad. Because he's losing the archers. So now, you have the uptime, but he lost quite some. Yeah, six archers. The Viper is not too far from clicking up. He's doing the market. But he still doesn't have the resources, so he has to be careful. Gujara is gonna be scary. Some is scary military when you make the castle late upgrades. Yeah, it's only 50 seconds away. He sell 100 stone. Well, Balz is going up without selling the stone. That's quite impressive macro. He should commit. He might if he commit now. Eh, he's risky. But maybe go in with the scouts and kill the layers. Nah, he's going around. Chicken. Yeah, he's attacking the, the RT range, but he's up. Basically, 15 seconds and he's up. He's going up now the Viper too, but this is going to be crossbows. It's 10 arches. Crossbows. Viper has a lot of army. Yes. A feudal army. And for a long time. Yeah, it's still two minutes. What the hell? Two minutes. These arches is a pity that they are at home. Imagine if those arches were already here. Yeah, he has a camel and one spear. But if the arches were coming, he will destroy. He will do a lot of damage. Obviously, he's at home bouts. Also, he lost the other group of archers before those. And the Viper is now doing a, what? a good job. Oh, wow. He's doing a really great job, the snake, keeping him there. Look at that micro. Love it. Still 1 minute 20 seconds to hold. And those scouts with bloodlines? No. He's not doing upgrades. No armor either. Uh-oh. Good micro again. And the scouts? Uh, but why he's sending the scouts? That's... Mm. Mm. Okay. I mean, those scouts are naked. He has no upgrades, and now he's going to lose them all. I don't understand what Viper is doing here with those scouts. Disaster. Oh, university. At least he's gathering information. He can see the university as well. And the snake now will have a lot of arches, horse collars, skirmishers. Village is the same. So he didn't take a single village with that army. But Almost less he than got three. time. Radagast! Thank you, man. And he's exploring... Okay. Castleage. Botkin arrow. Hmm. What is going to be the approach now? You know that his opponent had the university, but no goal and all to make the, the ballistic. He's doing an extra tone center. Look at the DC. Taking both a stone. I like it. And the university for the snake here. Crossbow and Botkin. Military numbers more for the snake. More for the Viper. He has the, the upgrade. And now at least skirmishers. Okay. Doing all the upgrades. So it's going to be fine. But Bals is still in an okay, solid position. Similar army. Now doing the tone center. He got Bozo even faster. Playing good, man. He's playing better than the first and the second. Yeah, because he already played very well on, on the third. And now, this army is there with the least skirmishers, with lose one armor as well. And that could be a problem. If he's doing ballistic, and he's going to make it already. Ooh. Okay. He's gonna be deadly. He got now more army than balls and these upgrades, this ballistic is sick. Why he didn't make the ballistic? Well, no goal and now he's doing PC, Siege War Shop, so he's kinda spending a lot of resources. But ballistic matters like crazy. 
Yeah, population is very close. Look at him. Four seconds. Three, two, one, zero. And if he's getting closer, he dominate. I mean, you dominate with the damn ballistic. Tone center behind the wood line. All right. And he see now a Magonal. So he go away because he feel scary with that with that siege workshop on top of that hill. He prefer to go around. Yeah, it's normal. Plus two armor. Wow, that helps a lot. Also, it really does. Population pretty much the same. Can't be closer the game. That's crazy. And now the ballistic. He's gonna notice. Just look how Balz is trying to dodge the arrows, but the damn ballistic. Let's make a difference, man. Look at population. Still ahead now with the army. And the KD, pretty much the same, but... Uh, will we'll change. Will really change. You see, another stone sent him. He bought the stone, and now he will have a stone on his own. Three TCs for both. Very close game still. Very, very close. Um, problem is... That Gurjaras, now he's doing riders. I like it. They don't have a good transition with archers. Gujaras don't have Arbalest, so if they keep going Arches, that's why I, I like to see Riders. Um, the Viper will have a better transition for the next age. Obviously, four villains more, solid. He has Will Barrow and, uh, well, sorry, Heavy Plow and Boso. Will Barrow too, but yeah, he's good Echo for both. A little bit better now for the Snake because of Heavy Plow, but he got more villains, so it compensates. Oh, Knights are ready. Crossbows and skirmishers. He has to be careful. Oh. Oh. He see the two minerals. It's scary. He need to go with the knights and kill. Oh my god. If he could see that, but he didn't. Yeah, those knights will dominate and kill the minerals. We'll yeah, we'll do it. But he went away. He went away. And Bals is still having 23 seconds idle TC. The Viper won many six seconds. He's having a very good macro in this game, the balls. The Viper has to be careful, man. Yeah. Yeah, Gujaras can be dangerous. He's still not doing many riders. I think he lost one now. Okay, and the camel. But he's coming with twist with two group of army at the same time. Is his villain down? Yeah, now that you see this army here, he can send. Look how he's doing. On the, at the same time, he sent this one and now the right one because he feel that ah, he know that he's coming, but he's ready. Vals is ready with good amount of farming, but he's not gonna be ready here. Well, it's wall, so he's ready also. Market, stone walls, the buildings. It's true that this army, he can kill many villages here, but he went away. This is now the siege workshop. And Vals is still with five villages more. Damn. Very close game. Super interesting. Let's see now. Oh, and he noticed right away. Oh, wow. Total watch is insane. Oh, he took the farm. He took the farm. And now... Oh, man. Well, the rider bye-bye. But now the Viper need to see this coming. Three mangonels, millions of archers, monk. And he's going to try to make the damage here. But that's why he did a siege war shot. Oh, Viper has a stone to drop a cast of balls as well. And this is the real question. Forward or defensive castle? I would love to see forward, but I have the feeling that... Uh-oh. No feelings anymore. It's forward. Oh, I love it. I love it. But Viper has a stone to drop a castle too. Where he's gonna drop the castle? Maybe here? Oh my god, this hill. I'm taking the gold. Uh-oh. But you see him with Magonel too. I think you don't want to take any risk. Castle here. I know that he has a good amount of farming, but Viper is now micro. He's coming with more archers. No, no, no. You need to make the castle here. You might lose now the, uh, the Mangonels. He's repairing this one. Ooh. But he's having quite a lot. Where's the other? Now with the skirms. The Viper is with some problems, but he has a lot of farming. 37, 19. My goodness. He is now killing absolutely everything. The Mangonel, the village is going to be down. No. But... With the Mangos, he's killing, but he lost a lot, Bals, here. Viper lost some, too, but with Mangonels, you know. And he didn't make the castle there, and now both plays with 1,200 wood. Splitting now those units, and try to micro. Okay. But the Riders, is a no or not? Mangonel? Oh. 
He's gonna kill it. Maybe not. Oh, good migrate shot. But guys, these riders now are starting to do the job. Another billion down. And he's doing a safe castle. Barbie's gonna make a castle in front of his base. More archer ranges, but he lost a lot. He really lost a lot to Viper. And now with his army in the hell. It was looking that he was doing a good micro, not anymore. He's going to repair the micro, like he has to. This is Riders. The Riders are so annoying. And he's gonna kill this one. No, the micro is down. And if he's not doing this castle, this can be deadly, but he will. He has a good castle and he will do it. The Viper is gonna go up to Imperial faster than his opponent. And now the Viper has eight villains more. How? I have no clue. I really have no clue. But it's because in this battle, his macro was better than Bals. Check the idle TC now. Viper is now get, getting some, but Bals was already with more idle time. And the Viper can click up to Imperial. Is clicking or not? No, it's not. I don't know why. He probably forgot. Or he thought that he clicked. Still not going up. But he could go. Castle on the left. Castle on the right. And is clicking imp or not? Bals has 40 farmers. So if he and Q will is. And handcart, he can go almost Imperial too. Imperial Age. Um, one question that in these maps, you, we don't think a lot about this. Um, these resources are still, but is worthy <clears throat> Pytorias? Oh, good castle, man. Do you have to be careful? He has one rider here. I don't know if he's will do a few knights. I think a few knights will be good. Or maybe light caps just to kill this siege. It's annoying. He's now moving the map. But the riders are going to be close there. So, it's it's so annoying this civilization. His good Jaros now is going to become harder and harder. Because those units are so fast. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Papi is doing mangonels. He's spamming. Doing some organ gun. And look at this here. To in a castle here to be safe, but the snake is up to Imperial Age. Oh boy, he's gonna kill the mangonel or not? Hey, with Billy, is okay, he will. Now he's going to convert the camel, converted the camel, and now he's gonna take the mangonel with that camel converted. My goodness, all right, but this is really bad. Oh, the crows are there, it's okay. Doing the castle on top of that hill, third castle. Now Imperial is from Bals as well. He has a lot less army, but he might have the mobility. I don't know if you answer about the Phytorias, but we'll find out anyway. He's Imperial now and <clears throat> light caps and barracks. He's gonna go house and light caps, maybe. But halves don't have mobility and you need to raid. And Bals Echo. It's quite okay. He has the hand card, no heavy blow, but hand card for some time ago. Not the Viper. Now doing the plus three. Oh boy. Doing a castle and now he's walling with the stone walls. Sick. Sick. Three villains that are going to die, probably. Yeah. He's gonna send two more and send him more. Uh oh. Oh boy. The rider. Anyway, plus three. He needs the traps. He's gonna make it or not? He has to make traps. The Viper has 20 idle villages. That's quite some. Quite some idle villages. And he's finding all the resources. Blue as well because he has the outpost. Population. I head for the snake. But I think the Viper need more farmers. I don't think 34 is an oath if you are getting now raided like crazy for, from Gujaras. This is Satrias. 25% cheaper. The Viper is going to go down. And this is stone miners gonna be well okay. <coughs> TC up, the less in the viper. You have to, but those riders, well, they are kind of hard to kill. More barracks and pulse is gonna be now in imperial. Let's go and taking the score lead. Whoa, okay, oh, really okay, Gurjaras. Yep. He's going to convert something with the monk. I don't know. One relic per player. Still coming. The relic is here. He want to take it. But Viper, 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 Viper. All right. He has 18 Sibansa riders. 
His opponent has arches and pikes, but you don't have mobility, Snake. He has, and that can be complicated. Still, he has a lot more army, plus four. Okay. He's coming with the arches and with the pikes. Soon we have halberdiers, probably. Taking the goal, and this is elite Sivansa riders. Probably he will need a castle here. He will need castles all over the map. Those riders are so annoying. Halvar Diaz is on the way, but the riders are coming. You need to put the pikes. He's gonna lose the traps. At what price? How many riders he's gonna lose? Oof. Oof. Maybe all. Maybe all of them, but the trap which are down, and that's worthy. Maybe. 52 army, 10 army. You need army, Mr. Balls. Maybe he's gonna go now. Shathran Rowers, yes, but you cannot lose the traps. Still, the Viper 200 population, Pals 160 with 143 pillars. He is still raiding, which is annoying, very annoying. Bloodlines now, okay. And now he has the hill. And he can do Bomber Cannons, he's chopping the trees, okay, good accuracy. Arval is upgrade, still missing the plus four armor and no hand card. Well, that matters. Can't cart matters. Oh, few knights. Yeah, well, raiding villages. That's the way to go. Killing villages. Killing economy. And here we... Oh, he's also raiding. Wow. He doesn't have mobility, but Viper is raiding now with Harvalis and Hals. Yeah, and he do not notice. He do not notice. Obviously, those Zathran Throwers are going to destroy now the trap. Uh-oh. He's trying to repair, but he can't. Because he's there faster. Oh boy, Fambry now. And he's inside, he's in the farmers. It makes that Vals cannot have a lot of farming, he's not massing a lot. He has to pay attention to several spots. And here, I don't know, Viper 2 relics. The rider killing few villages and uh, 190 population. Vals got very good resources, man. He's gonna go to Imperial again? My goodness, again? Well, both fighters are in Imperial. This is Elite Safran Travers, I believe. Yeah. And those units are very, very strong and dangerous. He's gonna kill. He's killing them. The Halves are helping. Yeah, man, but the Halves. Oof. The Halves. Ay, 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 the Halves. Okay. Yeah, but look at the Riders, man. Doing the job. And killing a lot. Killing a lot with little units, but killing a lot. Not so many units. Okay. Look at this, man. Whoa. He took all the Arbalest here. And now the halves, they cannot raid. And two traps. The castle is on the hill and it's almost impossible to kill. He's coming with bomber cannons, but he's coming with bomber cannons as well. More halves are needed and... Hmm, I don't know. Uh-oh. Make a gate, maybe. Doing another castle here to, to protect the gold. Well, but for that, victorious, man. He won population, guys. If you do fight Torian, you have to delete the list, you know? Otherwise, it's impossible. 200 pop right now. Two traps. It's gonna be a, now a bomber cannon. All right, this castle is so important. Let's see if the Viper can see it. The bomber cannon coming too. I mean, he is definitely on his range. And, and the snake. The snake, do not know. He's gonna lose the trap. He does. He does not. The Arbalists are coming. He's gonna repair. Ooh. Difficult. The Halberdiers are coming through the right side. And this is plus four. Bomber cannons will help here to take the Viper. But guys, how many villains got now on gold the Viper? It's very important if the game keep going like this. How many villains got the Viper on gold? I love to do this, guys. I love it. But he's... Fuck. Now it's six. Okay, it was zero. But, but now... And two relics. Okay. <laughs> but you are slow. You are slow, it's not my fault, guys. If you are slow and don't know how to say zero, it's your fault, not mine. But well, anyway, two bomber cannons, two trebuchets, and be careful now. Siege Engineer, one range more. This castle is so important. This is annoying. It's now getting more and more map, and it's looking good for the snake. But Vals is not gonna give up. He shouldn't give up because it will be the last game of him in the tournament. And now, ooh, those Chathran Throwers are killing a lot of units, man. Oh my God. Yeah, they are very strong. Look how he's dropping population, the Viper, dropping population dramatically. And here, 
the Viper with a Rider is losing so many. This Rider has killed already six villains, which is quite some. And, okay. The castle? The castle? He's gonna go down? No! And now he's gonna lose those traps. Ooh, he lost one. Need to go back. Yet yeah, those units are very, very deadly. Archibus. Wow. Well, Archibus is ballistic for the bomber cannons with 13 range. And that's pretty sick, you know? Pretty sick. <laughs> ballistic for those units is just crazy. And we'll see now. Okay. Well, population 154. He's behind in villages than Bals. Yeah, but Bal has no army. I mean, no army. He has some, but... Uh, nine throwers? She's lighter than one bomber cannon. That's it. The Viper still has 36 now. Okay, he's getting closer. So... The game is gonna keep going for a while. Bal's three relics. Three relics. He's coming here? No, no. It's wall, man. I mean... Bal's is a stone wall. You know? Obviously, in front is not wall, but... He has castles and, well, trying to defend. Military numbers is getting closer. Population now, Bals is ahead. Look at the score. Ay, 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 this game. Okay, getting closer to one hour now. Now the hand card. Okay. And this is a light cap. And remember that if he can make hazards. Oh boy. Well, solid. Let's see here. Don't lose the house. Don't lose the house. But attack. Yeah, the light guys just melt against this. Yeah, you see they're dead. So fast. These light guys can notice immediately two bullets are all in the TC. Now a third one, but he's outside that. He didn't garrison. Come on, man. That was a bit sloppy. But Bals now has more army than the Viper. More army than the Viper. Crazy. 52 army, the Viper population is struggling like crazy, now 160, and just look at the resources, you know? I mean, he has good echo, the Viper, but it seems that he's unable now, oh. Oh, the Viper can see the stone, but not the gold. Yeah, he should move. His castle is still alive. Forever? And ever? Okay, look at the throwers. Trebuchet down. He's gonna try to kill the bomber cannons. The halberdiers will help, but the flowers are gonna kill everything. Ay, 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 Viper is dying, man. The Viper is dying. Gurjabras is dominating now. 17 army, 41 army. I can't believe what I'm watching. Is the Viper going to lose the game and then we go to the Cider game? It's possible. It is possible, man. Whoa. Not controlling the units and now losing a lot of this. Yes, he's raiding. And this is happening because the walls are real well. It's open. But, yeah, he got the castles, one, two, three castles, and the snake is trying to catch up now. Let's see. Numbers, 38th army, doing all the upgrades. Okay, and here, Viper doing his tables. But now the problem is that his army, I mean, he's light gas. He has elite, elite riders and Sephiroth so Throwers also fully upgraded. Yep. While his light guys are not plus four. Now he's coming with the helps and Arbalus. Viper again with a lot of army. More army again than Vals. Population is getting closer. Crazy. Crazy battle, crazy game. Here is still getting raided. Now the Viper is not raiding at all, Vals. And that's the problem he has, this snake. Because if you check the mini map, Viper is getting raided constantly. Hazard upgrade and no ballistic. Okay. And this is an okay castle for sure. But Kassar upgrade, man. Ooh. Well, Arbalists are doing the job, but guys, look at the... What is this Frisbee's units, man? I mean, seriously. The Frisbee's are just killing all. Oh my god, the Arbalists disappear. We still have a lot of army. Yes, but those Trowers, man, what the hell? Okay. Yeah, it's not splitting the archers. It's, it's been all together, and that was definitely bad. 62 army now is spamming light caps and halves. Obviously, the army Viper has is not great. Well, the halves is good, but Gujara's army now is just scary. Look at the score, it's still very close like, really, really close. 60 farmers is gonna, gonna, gonna raid. This is very good. TC on the goal and stone and raiding finally. And now, raiding with the light caps, still not plus four. You need plate barred in armor. 
Blade Bard and Armor, and what Viper need to kill is this 28 Elytra Thran Throwers. Good castle. Good castle here for, for Baz to keep getting more and more army, more and more economy, because this some gold, some stone is good. It's good. He can see it. Well, he see this. Viper 200 population 2. All right, military numbers similar, but seriously. Uh, Hazards and Throwers versus Arbalest, Lightcaps and Halves. Lightcaps that are not fully upgraded. He's gonna be able to kill with this? Okay. We'll try. This is spamming both with similar numbers, but those Throwers are just eating all. Look at the Frisbees. Frisbees domination. Frisbees domination, really. You need to kill them. And I don't know if he's gonna be able to kill them. Hazards are raiding. More Halves. Ooh. You need army all over. And the Viper is... Dying, man. He's gonna die. I can't believe it, man. He started game number one and game number two really smooth. Then game three was playing good, but Baal did a great strategy. And here, it's feel like... Like Gujaras can dominate Portuguese or the Viper will be able to keep going. Poof. It's difficult. I know the caster here. Yes. And another one. Yes, I know. Okay. Controlling more and more map. Look at now the stables here. 57 farmers, but not a massive rating. And it's still missing upgrades for the light gaps. All right. The score is almost the same. It's still going. But it doesn't feel that now Portuguese can win. I don't know. Do you think Portuguese can win now? <laughs> And even more with one relic more for 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 balls. It doesn't feel that they can. Yeah, but Fightorias don't kill. Fightorias give economy, but no units. And he has a stone to make another castle, maybe. I don't know where. Ooh. Okay, well, if there's no goal either, so Trebuchet here. He has no wood, and here this TC. He's in danger to be lost. He's spamming Hazards here. Okay, he's gonna lose. He's gonna lose it, sorry. He's still good population, Viper. Oh, now Bals is losing a lot of villages, guys. Yeah, look at the Echo KD. Bals is getting raided massively now. He dropped it like crazy, his village number. He dropped it a lot. 108 villages, he raided a lot with the light caps and he's losing quite some and now those casals are going to melt against the halves oh the viper is doing a great job here 200 pop on the left those three trebuchet and arbalas with halves oh my god he's gonna be able to kill those yeah no the castle is down but he still have the traps and now with the arbalas and the halves he should kill all the traps and if you kill this is really important you can kill now the castle too look at the village there job in the trees and Got it! He has a stone to probably drop another castle. But you don't want there, probably. Ooh, and here. Yeah, look at the army numbers. How you control the throwers is the key, probably. He's doing the castle again, just to take this one and get back the map control. All right. Viper is still with more population than his opponent. It seems that he's trying to get this area. No trebuchet, no gold, five on gold. And this castle is gonna go down. This is good for the snake. This is really good because there is also gold. Ooh. No, no, no. He can't really. And that castle will go down. I mean, he's five villages. Five villages won't, won't stop three traps. And you don't want to lose the arbalest. Here we are with more and more house and... Ooh. Many hussars. Now the viper has a lot of army. I mean, if you lose few villages here, maybe it's good. You need more army. No, no, no. No, no, no. The micro, man. Aye, aye, aye. Well, I don't think he's microing now properly in these units. Late part in armor, finally. And that castle is down. Really important. You can kill all those stables and then take some gold that is here. And going with the Arbalest. Gonna get it. Bam. Stables down. But he's raiding now. He's raiding. You know. Yeah. But he knows and he's fine. He's killing now some and... Finally, with the plus four, he's gonna come with the halves and the bomber cannot. Yeah. I mean, if he kill the castles, Viper can still win the game. It's crazy. Look at the score. And 200 population. Bals now 156. 
is gonna mind the goal. Is this one of those typical macro games from the Viper that it looks like he's gonna lose and then he never lose it and come back from the hell? Look like this. Wow, look at the snake now. 76 army raiding in that corner at 3 o'clock. And the bomber cannons now with the house and the arbalest will take the castle too. Whoa. And soon he won't have a stone even to repair. Another castle here. And another one. For the snake. Controlling the hills. Trebuchet coming. He can take the gold. Wow, he can't establish it. Oh. Shut up, man. Look at this army, man. And this is his base. Okay. I don't know. He's gonna take it. He's going with all that army, but... He's having a lot here. 67 population is at not 200, but he's coming, man. Castle is up and more ready. Now he will try to kill this castle. We'll try to kill all the castles. All right, bomber cannons with remember, ballistic. Calvar is you need to control those. The halves and the arbalest. The halves eat the hussars. This castle, where is the castle, man? It was here. Uh, this is the castle, guys. Well, looks good to me. And now, he's moving around. Going around with the bomber cannons. Okay. And taking this one. He will do more more barracks. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, this castle is down. And he's not gonna have many castles anymore. If he's killing this one, he's only two in front. But Val has 80 army, 50 hussars. And the Viper has 27 lights in the queue. But how many life gas on the field? Zero, guys. Literally zero. That's why now he's coming. Oh my god. Coming with all his army to this hill. Oh, crack it, the rain. Then the castle will fall much faster. No, no, those guys are. Oh, the bomber cannons. He need to shoot their, 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 their front flowers. He need to shoot. Oh my god. Well, he's gonna lose all. He's gonna lose all the Viper here or not? Well, he's losing all the Castars as well. But the Chafran Throwers are here. You need to repair the castle. And this is so important. The light caps. He need to kill the Throwers. But it's so difficult to kill. Whoa. Calvar Beers are now raiding all over. Okay. Everyone over, all over the map. Masonry. But the castle is gonna go down. No, it's killing the train. And the train which is survived. He survived because he's repaired. No, he killed it the same. No, but yes! Damn it! Okay, Masonry is gonna be. One H. Oh, he did it! And one trap only. And the bomber cannon here. The barber is holding this castle. And that castle is so important. He holds it! He holds it 200 population. The trebuchets are down. And now, that castle can give the Viper the game. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable how he holds that castle. What a hole there! With all the upgrades, 63 army, 44. Well, it's the same for both players, 160 population. And on the right, he's still taking gold. And he's... What? He's blocking to take the gold? All right. The trebuchet is going to be down. No, he's repairing, he's repairing, he's repairing in the last second. My goodness. All right, Viper is coming with the house. It's crazy game and now raiding here with the light because ladies and gentlemen the snake is winning the game and he's gonna face tomorrow the Canadian. Thank you for following. Well the last the last two games has been insane, you know? The last two games been insane brutal game i thought that boss could be able to come back and make a desire but the viper qualified for the quarterfinals tomorrow the viper hero yes the viper hero tomorrow okay that's gonna be brutality 3-1 for the viper in this series hopefully you enjoy it remember to join tomorrow because if today has been sick tomorrow is gonna be in another level statistics military and we didn't finish now tatito 76 army 80 army look at the kills economy holy moly pulse with 7000 resources more than the, the viper more gold more food viper only got more wood crazy 
And that was a beautiful series. Thumb up on YouTube, guys. Subscribe, leave a commentary, and what do you think? Was crazy casting? Hope you enjoyed.